welcome to FoodTube. I'm Katie Picks, and if, like me, you've come home and you've got half an hour before your favourite TV programme is on, and you think, oh, I just want a delicious dinner, but there's just no time. Well, there is, because we've partnered up with the Saucy Fish Co. to bring you one of their brand new Frozen range. Frozen just got cooler, and we're pairing that today with a delicious vegetable noodle stir fry that can be cooked up in just 30 minutes flat. So we are going to start off today with our saucy fish, in which I've got a delicious saucy salmon, sustainably sourced with a complimentary chilli lime and ginger dressing. Oh and in our box we've got a handy little oven bag that we're going to steam our salmon in. So this recipe is enough for two people. Delicious portions. By steaming the salmon, we're going to get a perfectly moist and delicious fish. If you get a little lost, worry not. The instructions are all over the packet. Now this is going to go into the oven at 170 degrees centigrade for 28 minutes. Okay, so now that's in the oven. We've now got 28 minutes to make the perfect side dish. And frankly, I'm going to mimic those gorgeous oriental flavours that come out in the salmon with our vegetable noodle stir fry. So first of all, noodles. I've got here a nice pot of boiling water and I'm just going to cook up 125 grams of fine free-range egg noodles. And you're just going to cook those as per packet instructions. So whilst those are cooking for three or four minutes, I'm going to make our sauce, which is super simple. And we're going to take a tablespoon and a half of plum sauce. We're then going to add in half a tablespoon of honey. The juice of one lime. And then we're going to also add a bit of seasoning in the form of soy sauce. So we're going to give that a little mix up and bring all those flavours together. Our noodles are ready, so I'm going to drain those off in a colander and then I'm just going to run some cold water through it and just leave them to the side. Lovely, so now it's time to prep our veggies. So we're going to start off with some Chinese cabbage here. Now you can get this really easily in any generic supermarket. Okay, so we've just got about a quarter of a Chinese cabbage here. One red pepper, which is just going to be finely sliced. Three spring onions. So we're just going to lop off the ends and I'm just going to go at an angle with my knife and just chuck through them. And then we're just going to add in our sugar snap peas, which I've got 50 grams. About one and a half centimetres of ginger and one clove of garlic. Now our final prep is done. It's time to bring it all together in a perfect little harmonious family of gorgeous oriental flavours. So we've got a massive wok. I'm going to pop on a nice high heat with half a tablespoon of vegetable oil. We'll be adding in all our flavours and everything will time perfectly with our salmon in the oven just hanging back there. To our pan, we're going to add in our ginger and our garlic. Now it's time to add in our fresh veggies. So we're going to start with our spring onions, our red peppers and our Chinese cabbage, our gorgeous little sugar snap peas. I'm going to give that a nice good stir. So these just need about a minute on the heat and do not be tempted to turn your heat down at this point. I know you're thinking, but it's sizzling, but that is okay. That's what we want. Okay, so we've got a few little extra ingredients straight from the freezer, in fact, because we are loving that today. So we've got 50 grams of frozen peas and we've got 50 grams of bean sprouts that are going in there as well. And then we're also going to add in our noodles. Don't forget about them, they're right there. Then we're going to pop a lid on. So keep that heat high, another two minutes. Lovely. So we're just going to push everything to one side and we're going to add in our sauce combination to the side of the pan. And then once you've got that sauce a little bit reduced, we're going to mix it through and your stir fry side is ready to rock and roll. So our sides are done, our salmon is near perfectly cooked and all that's left to do is to heat up our delicious saucy chilli lime and ginger dressing. So to heat the sauce, we're going to place the sachet in a pan of simmering water for four minutes. Do be careful when you open it up, because as you can imagine, it's going to be nice and hot. But now we're ready to plate up our delicious dinner. Fish is super healthy, but people struggle with how to cook it. This meal couldn't be simpler. So there you have it. Doesn't it look pretty? A beautiful salmon with a saucy chilli, lime and ginger dressing on a bed of vegetable stir fry. It's zingy, it's vibrant, it's absolutely delicious. Guys, for more information, make sure you check out the link for the saucyfishco.com in the box below, and I shall see you next time. Bye!